Chris Roth, when he came to the scene here with with uh, with Chicago, you know, right off the bat, he was he had an unbelievable season, and then he was really unbelievable in the final third. He was one of those players that made me want to go out to games, maybe want to go and watch games because he was really special. You know, he was technically so gifted, uh, so good in tight spaces, and he was one of those guys that, you know, when he scored goals, you know, you, you can look at all the goals he scored and that could be in a, in a highlight, uh, highlight film, you know, and uh, he, he, he was just, he had that kind of quality, uh, I think, that, that drew you to games when you knew the team was playing, you know, and, and he was a part of that team. You wanted to go and watch those games because you just felt every time he was on the field, every time he touched the ball, that he was going to do something special. And uh, the goals that he scored, man, I think there have been some some great goals and uh, he just had that kind of quality that uh, he, he, you know, fans wanted to go out and, and make sure that they didn't miss a game that he was a part of when the team was, was playing. For me, I had the ability to, you know, watch him play, not, not knowing him as a person, you know, from, from the stands. And then once I worked with the team, I, you know, had that, that special privilege to be able to see this guy every day in training and see how special he was as a player. Uh, and then obviously had the opportunity to coach him, got to know him as a person. And, uh, he, uh, you know, he was a special player on the field, but he was even a better uh, person off the field. His quality is really good, quiet person, uh, worked extremely hard, loyal, uh, dependable, you know, and uh, just, a, just a class person all around.